Welcome to this new moon in Leo, July 2022, guided meditation. This meditation has been designed to help you harness the energies of the Leo full moon so that you can make the most of this manifesting period. For more meditations like this and for others, be sure to subscribe to my channel. This new moon can have the ability to make us feel out of sorts and maybe even impulsive. New moons are also a time for manifestation. And so this meditation is going to help you become very clear in where it is that you're going so that you can be more intentional and not become the victim of these impulsive energies that can derail your momentum forward towards your goals. New moons are a time for a fresh start. And this moon is also encouraging us to be proactive in what it is that we want for our life, to be fully present in the moment and to let go of the things that are holding us back. This moon is also encouraging us to harness the power of self-validation instead of looking for validation and motivation outside of ourselves. So when you're ready, go ahead and take a nice deep breath in through your nose and out through your mouth, making sure that you're in a quiet place where you can sit or lie, making sure you're totally comfortable. And on your next nice deep breath in and out, allow your eyes to gently float shut. Taking another nice deep breath in through your nose, calling all your energies home to your core. Any pieces of you that you've left out in the world anywhere, calling them back to you now. And as you exhale, just setting the intention to let go of anything that no longer serves you. To let go of anything that is out of alignment with where you want to be, where you want to go in your future. Just noting that it's not necessary to identify what it is that you're letting go of. Just set that intention and let your unconscious mind take care of the rest. When you're ready, see yourself floating up out of now and into a magical place where you can be fully present without any distractions, without any fear of judgment, place where you feel safe and comfortable to be fully who you are. And as you arrive in this place now, just allow yourself to become fully present in this moment. Noticing anything that's happening in your body or around you. Using each one of your senses to be in this moment. Remembering that this moment is the only moment that we have. And the more that we can become fully present in the moment, and the more that we can receive this moment as perfect, just the way it is, regardless of what's happening, the more we amplify our manifestation abilities. Oftentimes, it's not that we have a manifestation problem, but it's that we have a receiving problem. So the more that we practice receiving this moment as perfect, just the way it is, recognizing that we need this moment as it is for our personal growth, the better we become at receiving, and the better we become at receiving, the more easily we can receive our manifestations. Also, the more present that we can become in any given moment, the more likely we are to recognize our manifestations coming to us. When we are so busy rushing from moment to moment, worrying or constantly thinking about a future moment that's not here yet, or a past moment that no longer exists, we rob ourselves of being aware of what's coming to us in this moment. And we may miss the signs 
that our manifestations are about to arrive. So what is it that you can feel in your body and on the surface of your body? Is there anything that you can smell, taste, touch, hear? And what is it that you see in your mind's eye? And when you're ready, fully present in this moment, I want you to imagine the very first thing that you want to manifest, your first goal that you have for yourself. And as you think of this goal, imagine that you're receiving it right now in this moment. What would that feel like? What are the things you would hear, the things you would see? Are there any smells or any tastes to go with it? Use every one of your senses as you imagine that this manifestation is coming true in this present moment. As you think about this thing that you're wanting to receive, Ask your unconscious mind, what do I need to believe to be true in order to receive this manifestation? If we believe, for example, that we are not worthy, we won't be aware of the manifestation coming to us when it does. We take ourselves out of energetic alignment with the manifestation if we hold beliefs that don't serve us. So what do you need to believe to be true in order to receive this manifestation? And when you're ready, asking your unconscious mind if there are any beliefs that you currently hold that oppose the beliefs that you need to receive this manifestation? Do you have any limiting beliefs that would cancel out this new belief that you are taking on? And when you're ready asking your unconscious mind What behaviors do I need to engage in? Maybe daily, weekly, monthly. What behaviors do I need to engage in in order to receive this manifestation? To increase my momentum and move towards receiving this manifestation. finally asking your unconscious mind what evidence will I see on the journey to receiving this manifestation oftentimes we stop our own momentum because we believe that the manifestation isn't coming to us because we have no external evidence that it's coming When we can plan in advance, though, the evidence that will give us the self-validation that we are making progress towards our goals, we're able to stay the course, trust, and lean into the unknown, and keep moving forward every single day. So what is the evidence that you will see on your journey to receiving this manifestation. The more evidence that you can plan for, the more
more you'll be able to self-validate and keep yourself on track on this journey. And if there is more that you want to manifest than just this one thing, go ahead and repeat these exact same questions with each manifestation and each goal that you have. Being sure to experience receiving the manifestation right now with each and every one of your senses. And then asking your unconscious mind, what beliefs do I need to have in order to receive this manifestation? Do I have any belief systems that contradict these new beliefs that I'm receiving? What behaviors do I need to engage in to move towards my manifestation? And what evidence will I see on my journey to receiving this manifestation? And when you're ready, bring your hands over your heart. And saying out loud, I am open and ready to receive. And saying out loud, I know that I am safe enough to receive this manifestation now. And saying out loud, on this journey to receiving this manifestation, I will remain fully present in the present moment and I will look for evidence that my manifestation is coming to me. And then see an infinite source of love, light, healing, wisdom and understanding pouring through the top of your head from the universe and filling you up with all these new belief systems that you need in order for your manifestations to come true. This is the first point of receivership for you, is receiving the downloads and the installation of these new beliefs to move you towards your manifestations. When you've fully received all of these belief systems, from the universe, placing your hands over your heart and saying thank you. Thank the universe for these new belief systems and for working with you to co-create your future. And thank yourself for being open enough to receive. And thank yourself for taking this time to invest in your future to accelerate the process of your manifestations. When you're ready, you can come back into your body, back into this present moment. And you might like to wiggle your fingers and toes or wrap yourself up in a hug. And when you're ready, go ahead and open your eyes. I would encourage you to take a couple moments to write down the answers that you received during this meditation, the new belief systems that you have received, and the evidence that you'll look for along your path to your manifestation. Thank you for joining me today for this powerful meditation to make sure you never miss another meditation again, be sure to subscribe to my channel. Namaste.